Ugh, Skaven. I don't like playing against Skaven. Hi, by the way. So, I have the lowest team value, 170k in petty cash. Let me see what they got here. Extra arms for the thrower, one tackle storm vermin, which is a problem. Five fan factor level 20. Okay, he's a decent coach. Three rerolls. How many are there? 16, 15, 14, 13 players. Okay. And this guy is out of order. Great. Wrestle kick. Interesting. And that's uh, a kick in the groin. Okay. 170, that's uh, screaming for a wizard, but let's see if we can buy something else. Morgan Sorg, obviously not. Willow, that's the guy. What do we have here? Dauntless Strength 4, that's actually pretty cheap for Strength 4 guy. Sidestep, Dauntless. I might go with him. Rather than a wizard. Bertha. Bertha. Big Bertha. Whatever. Helmut, no. It doesn't last long enough. Though they are level. And uh, I, I would need a bribe for him. Let's go with the strength four piece. Of course, why not? Yeah, I like playing in zones, but sometimes you just get crushed no matter what. It's just that armor value 7 is really a problem. So, hmm, gotta keep that one tackle storm vermin busy. Maybe try to cut him off from the uh, main thing uh, that's going on and uh, yeah maybe he, I don't know well, what kind of armor does Willow have does he have armor value 7 as well I might uh, put him to the task of now he has idea so he can actually look for that storm worm in a bit Defense. Should I? Yes, we can risk it. Yeah. I'm on value 8. At least you can close that gap here then. Just some random nine women in here. Well, she's almost ready to level up. 2 6. Five out of six. Let's get one of the newer ones in here then. Okay. How many? Four substitutes. That's neat. We do want the catcher on the pitch here. Um. Okay, cool. Let's put them inside since this will probably hold. Maybe. Yeah, maybe not. Let's see. Good luck. Um, um, he has no red ogre, so that's good to know. What is his movement? It's pretty shit. Five. That's weak. Even worse than our standard players. <coughs> no. Okay. We'll see, we'll see how it all goes. So that's a uh, dirty player at one. He likes to foul, but he doesn't have a bribe. One substitute. The other one is injured. Strange love. <laughs> Uh, 
So we have the usual five guys here on the line of scrimmage to get rid of the three defenders. Oh, here's a strength guy, strength gutter runner. Ooh, we never had that yet. Sweltering heat. Roll a d6 for each player on the pitch. On a roll of one, the player collapses. This didn't. Ooh, nice. The tackle did work there. Uh, so we're down to two rerolls here. He has the fan factor. How much block does he have? Like four. No. Three and one wrestle. Yeah. So the question is, as always, should we engage or disengage? Um, let's close this gap. You can still blitz uh, and punch a hole in there. Oh, he doesn't have... <laughs> I'm so used that every to having dodge with everyone here, but he, of course, doesn't have dodge. I should have taken block. Uh, that was stupid of me. So that's why he was. No, I don't have. Yeah, would have been better to to take block. Well, I couldn't really. Oh man, I'm confused. <laughs> Let's just skip this conversation. I have to rewatch that to make sense of what happened here. Could I choose? No, I don't think I could. Hmm, oh, nice. Okay, so this, this is a two-tier uh, uh, screen here. Let's see what we can do about this. I don't want to give them extra rolls here. Uh, where's that stupid tag of Roman there? Yeah, you go next to him. That's definitely a thing that I want to do. And we're not opening up here yet. If we. No, maybe we should cheese the, choose cheese. Why am I thinking of, of cheese when I play uh, against Romans here? Against this game? We should choose um, the one that's furthest away, I guess. Does have armor value eight, of course. Uh, push him up there. Stay. Nope. So, hmm. <laughs> Let me close this gap. And well, I can stay like that for now. Mm, yeah, why give, give up some room? We don't have to. We can get a bit closer here, but mm, on the other hand, we need to maybe rush back. So it's a good position to be here. So we can almost reach everything if they just run away. Okay, let's get you up as well. Dodge. Looking good so far. Yeah, so there's a certain concentration here now. I'm alright with this. Some double things. They can go all the way around here if they want to. But then I can, like, push from the side. I think I can deal with that. Hmm, switching lanes. Interesting. Mr. Tackle is attacking. Makes sense. I should have marked him. 
It's a moment, it's like all my girls don't have dodge as long as he's attacking you. So we're down one woman. Yeah, we need to catch up a bit. He's already hiding. Focus. Focus on the weaker ones for now, I guess. <clears throat> He's just waiting to get a pass mm -hmm. as well. He's a ball carrier type. It's almost like he's preventing me from getting through. That's odd. Dauntless. Hmm. But swings four. And sidesteps. So he's not that easy to get rid of if we break through. Okay. He has cakes, that's also important. I don't want to close anything yet here. Um, let's see. Let's attack this guy. Weakening this side further is if this fails. Marking him. Stay. Okay, for the moment, it's more even. Hmm. I think I want to mark this guy twice to make it a little more difficult to attack these people here. Sort of a second screen, but if they get through here, then that is the problem. Let's hmm, just weaken this. Yeah, this. Let's leave it like this. Because here there are two guys here. He, he can only blitz one of them away, so we can dodge through here, I guess. Maybe. Hmm. Okay, this time he's not escaping. He's a huge problem. I really have to deal with him fast. Also, there's sweltering heat. The second woman, she KO uh, he KO'd now. This is a surf, if we do it right. Gotta catch up. We should have an advantage when it comes to sweltering heat, but you never know. We have more players in the box. Hmm, he's just stalling. Should I start marking players? Not sure that's wise. I could try to foul my way back into the game, but... Attacking this guy. Man, this side is already pretty open. I need to decide soon how to go on about this because... What if we base him? Put your hole in here. No, I think we want to do something there. So now... Okay. Kinda wanna... There's a stupid storm worm in there. Hmm. I can not really reach here anyway, so... Let's go here for now. Um, I can get counter-served. 
I'm gonna watch out how we do this. Yeah. <clears throat> Can you reach? Yeah, sorta. But the way is closed at the moment. Um, let me see. Let's open the left side. We are losing too many players here to keep this up. Hmm. That's not ideal. Stay here for now. Hmm. We don't have block. I would have to dodge into attack him though, and I don't want to do that. And she can get counter served as well, so this has to wait a bit, I guess. I think it's all right. Um, he will get up next turn. Okay. He can easily punch a hole in here now. Let's leave it like this. There's a little pressure on here. Yeah, he can switch sides, but he will lose a bit of movement doing that. I have three rerolls, he has two. Mm. Man, there are a lot of things to consider here. Yeah, he's seeing an opportunity here with my weak left side. Changing. Oh, there's someone going for a scoring threat. Interesting. Where's the tackle guy? There, and I can reach with him. I also could consider putting him there, but that's not worth it. We will dodge out. He's just a lineman though. He needs to dodge out as well if he gets up. He hasn't fouled yet. Can I reach? I can't, could reach and mark him if I wanted to. Should we deal with the scoring threat? Let's see what happens here first. That will determine the rest of the play. If it works, then I can let him. Yeah, if it stays like that, that's fine as well can push him into this and then we'll have another attack. It's just a line then. Um, yeah, I kind of want to have my blotch pieces there where the ball is. Because they're a bit stronger. So, bring you right in front of the tackle piece. Um, you support this here. So now we have to die on the storm woman with another chance here. And you have blood. Hmm. Okay, let's keep you moving. All on the storm worm in there. It's a tackle. 
This is open now pretty much. They are a bit too far away if he rushes through. But if we deal with the scoring threat first, we should be fine. Yeah, pretty nice. Follow up. Nice. Evening things out a bit more. <coughs> she she got her runner. Okay, so they can still go through here. Um let's see if we need her. We have three rewards, so we're good. We can use one. St uh, follow or stay, stay. Definitely stay to make this harder. This is a little harder rail. Let's stay here. Right, just to connect that wall. You can invest a lot of players in here to get in some um, blocks, I guess. Hmm. Do we really want to close this? You will get through here anyway because you can just push me with one square. If I go here, he will more likely move towards the center again. If I stay here though, he can just pass and have maybe a chance to put some pressure on him on the sideline. So let's leave it open. Was still one girl down here. I'm not sure how f much he wants to stall, but not all of these pieces will be able to get around here to support a cage. A lot of movement is lost here this way. Okay, this is some sort of a screen, but if since he made a connection, I can push him away. Oh, he has plus one movement. Interesting. Okay, this storm vermin, thank god, doesn't have tackle. Yeah, he can score next turn, but we have like plenty of time to counter score, I'd say. Just need to keep some pressure on here. Maybe we can, I think we can even reach. Yes, plus one, so it will be a one die against no block. But who picks it up then? Nobody. <laughs> no, he can attack here now. There's a one die. That's another reroll gone. So now, actually, this is starting to matter. Rerolls are starting to matter. He's not getting up. Another piece left to move. Okay. Oh, he's dodging. Okay. Let's see how we can pressure those dudes. You're free. Um, I don't want to let him go here. Uh, I think I go right in front of him so I can mm, jump, dodge out and move back as well, if need be. And um, it's a two die against the tackle boy. Okay, more pressure on here, please. Um, Yeah, we can easily reach, actually. Your blotch... Should we keep this going? Hmm, maybe you can pick up the ball if we're lucky. Hmm. Let's leave him there for now. Okay, this is not easily dissolved. Hmm... Yeah, she's building some sort of a screen. 
With a reroll, maybe we can get to him. <laughs> we have enough reruns. Nope, don't need to. Do we want to follow up? Yeah, put pressure on him. She can get served, but okay. I will box him in. His best piece, or one of his best pieces, is out. <laughs> Thank God my guy, my girls are just uh, KO'd, not injured. So the ball is out in the open. Let's... Hmm. Yeah, we can put on more tag rounds. Which then we op would open up the screen here. Should we just try to box him in? He can dodge out and he has a lot of movement. And they can get him around anyway, so maybe I should do this. Also helps against the threat of getting served. Two reruns, mm, not like in this. One die with no reruns. No, let's leave it. Leave everything as it is up there. It's marked. Uh, we have still three reruns, so let's try putting another tackle on on the ball there. Nice, very nice. I'm happy with this. Should we try this? This is not a... he's a loner, so the reroll doesn't really work, I guess. No, I, mean, I want to keep him marked. He's doing too much damage, and I, I'd rather fight him uh, armor value 8 than 7. His apple is already gone, one reroll. But one reroll is enough to score here now. This is a... Uh, delicate situation here <laughs> because if he stalls long enough I cannot score so if I lose control here then this will be a win for him in this um, half it's right at the edge of uh, where I can still score so this turn might be alright but it's already starting to get worse. Like four turns would be good. Three turns is already a bit shaky. Let's see what's happening here. Okay, we're one piece down again. How are or are we? Yeah, let's see where. There's another blitz incoming, maybe? Or to die against? No, he will probably support this here somehow. Is this a matter for the pickup? This and this matters. But he is not a strong guy that got a runner with strengths too. And these guys all have a agility 3 and need to dodge without a dodge. And when we roll, he also needs to pick up the ball so that will more likely be a gutter runner. <laughs> there goes the reroll. That matters because the pickup is now more difficult. Though so that matters too, of course. Only a knockout now. Still two tackles on the ball. Interesting. I take it. 50% uh, without a reroll. Ah, shit. And he has dodge. And he's not going for it. Oh, yeah, well. Ah, uh, yeah. So we have three rounds now. Hmm. It's doable. But all everything has to work here now. What's, what about the sweltering heat? Four guys, so I'm one person down. And he is three guys. Uh, let's see, one or two guys down. Three, nine. I think he has one less player than me. Yeah. 
nine. Well, I have three, six, nine, ten, eleven, fourteen. Even. Amazing. Who is out, by the way? The catchers. Two catchers, of course. The only time I'd need them. Fuck. Sweltering heat. The only catcher that was still in there. So he, uh, sweltering heat, uh, was like even. One for each. No. Actually not. Those are two guys out with sweltering heat. So it's better for me. Yeah, well what kind of agility do you have three? He does have kick, we gotta remember that. That also is a problem. There he is. So he's probably going to kick it deep, and we're not at, at that good as at handing the ball. We can use a reroll, or should we use a reroll every turn now? <clears throat> Otherwise, they go to waste. Um, okay, I put you here. You can get the edges. Yeah, here I need the damage. Man, not enough block players anymore here. Two of them are out. Invest two players on this side. Yeah, they just have to make a run for it and survive somehow. I'm not even sure if I want to do this with the loner. Be honest. Um, he might kick very deep, so I will already go a bit uh, back here. No, normally, I like to put them a little in front of the center here. Is that really the center? Three, five, three, five, or well, sort of. <laughs> Okay, let's see what the kickoff brings. <clears throat> Free bonus turn, that's especially bad for skating. Now it's almost more important to not let him score. We can push her away and then, like, spill in here with, yeah, well, three or four players. But on the other hand, that opens up the room for these guys, if that works. But that will mean that there will be plenty of um, Skaven waiting as a scoring threat then here. No, he's doing something else. That's a one-die attack. Interesting. That last attacker player. Got a free attack in again. Hmm. No, he's not giving up his formation there. Interesting. Some sort of screen here. Leaving, giving me the edges here. And the center. That's a moment. Oh, there's one skull like that. I will have to blitz him. We didn't get a reroll though. Oof, that went well, actually. Um, cool. Let me see. Place you in front of him. Maybe I won't blitz you. Um, 
Let's see how far can you reach there. Maybe build a sideline cage here. And hope nobody dodges in. Already go for the scoring threat here. Also threaten the guys that are waiting here for the cage to move. Um, yeah, that's okay. Nice. Skip. So, let's see. Gain some ground here with uh, Sidestepper. Like this. A uh, sideline cage. <clears throat> they don't have any plus agility pieces. Okay. Push you here, follow up. I can use a reroll here. Okay, now it's getting a little better. Um, do I want to support the cage? I think I have to. Okay, yeah, I do. Leave that idiot alone and free up more players here. Uh, reinforce the sideline cage here a bit more. This is also a screen, by the way. I want to box him in, the gutter runner. I think the cage is alright for now here. It is weak here, but there's a screen, so I will box him in. But then this guy is free to do whatever he likes, I guess. Well, he cannot score yet, so let's just box the gutter runner in. Let's see what happens then. Um. Two, turn, two turns left. Ne need to move quite a bit now. Quite a chunk. I'm not sure he has enough players to... to like got everything and there's already a scoring threat here. Six, three, six, seven, one going for it. Hmm, interesting. <clears throat> Will he dodge out? Otherwise I get two blocks on him. Okay, good for him against the Blotch Girl here. I just get KO'd. That's the uh, bright side of things. And they are accumulating though now. Four KO's. Okay, tackle piece. Let's get you to the game again. Um, how do we do this? With a handoff? Build a cage in here? Well, we could try a handoff here. Let's deal with him first. That's good. Follow. Nice, that's, that was important. Now we can support the ball carrier here. Do we want to mark this guy? He would be one of the only ones that can really reach here, right? So, yeah, maybe I want to mark him. Mm, how far can you go? Up here. Okay, I think I don't want to pass then. Um, 
No, that's not what I want. That's better. That's already a going for it, but I need to attack him as well here. Um, I could lose a row. Yeah, let's let's be safe. Well, on the other hand, the storm woman is a problem. Hmm. <coughs> Okay, we, uh, I'm hoping this will go well with a hero. Not really. Stay. Which should be enough to bring some people into scoring position here. This is a hero. Yeah, it's not great. I'll take it for now. Mm, I'm lucky with the going for it. Those are all three, or maybe one, three, six, eight. Yeah, there are. Those are three scoring threats for the next turn. Um, you can dodge in here. And then a check, I guess. Reroll was a loner? Is that a good thing? I'm not sure. Oof. Um, did I use my blitz? Yeah, I did. How many can... Hmm. I might as well. Let's see how far can you reach. Yeah, let's let him go and threaten this even more. Because she's not that easy to get to. And even if she gets just not down and not stunned, she has a opportunity to, to dodge out here. And she can't be boxed in that easily here. Those squares are hard to cover. So it will depend on the pass a lot. Or handoff maybe. He's boxing us in as much as he can, of course. As much as he can. Can? Can? Can. <laughs> I'm a confused man. Yeah, I'm letting him go, but he could have blitzed no matter what. And that's what also can happen. So, you cannot reach, but you too can with a handoff if I blitz you away. So, we should do that. Let me see. Hmm. Uh, can we put up enough people here? Like, uh, plus one, yes, three, so six. Can we get in that many players? Maybe. Oh, I need you to blitz. Yeah, that's not working. So this this blitz is now three plus two plus uh hmm, crap yeah doesn't matter I just need him to push push him in, in here is this already a three die no it's not hmm. She can go through here no matter what. That 
this is three day. Against the storm vermin. Stay. Sadly nothing happened. Okay, mm so these are two going for it and a handoff. Doable? No, don't pass. Just hand over. Not impossible, but not easy as well. Ugh. Okay, not over yet though. Hmm. He doesn't have a turn anyway, so let's already go for it. Ooh, lucky. Ooh, I was sweating there. Jesus. Especially if the roll fails early and you gotta use your team reroll, even the easy things get uh, like a difficult task. Oh, by the way, what about. Oh, come on! Only four guys of mine, but they got some of the knockouts back. Three of the blood girls are out. Three, three, nine. And he has... Oh, is he? No, those are all injuries. What a mess. Three, six, nine. So it's nine versus nine? No. Okay. If I score quickly, I get a lot of people back, I guess. I'm not sure I want to do that against Skaven. Hmm. Should we, like, start slow? Mm, nah, I think he has the better players. With, he can do more damage at the moment. <laughs> While my girls are busy guarding some sort of a cage. Hmm, that is an interesting setup. Okay, let me see, put you here, you don't have any skill, put you here, oh now the catchers are back, great, <laughs> not that I really need them, okay, this is a bit odd, but yeah, the kick guy is still alive, right, alive and kicking. So we need to stay where we are here. <clears throat> hmm. The war of attrition is pretty weird for this game. I do the lasting injuries, but that doesn't matter to us for this game at the moment. Not getting enough pieces back. <clears throat> That's a deep, deep kick. Oh, something good for me. Well, wow, that could be brutal. Um, where is that storm vermin idiot there? Let's try to get a little closer to him. I don't know if you can reach. Probably not. Uh, this doesn't matter anymore, so we can go back. One square. Um, I guess we can shift now. Closer to where the ball is. Okay. And? 
Ah, at least the scatter is somewhat decent. No, we're not even getting close enough for this. Okay, we might as well put up some screen up here then. Hmm, a bit odd. But it will have to do. Yeah, he's he's a slow mofo. Totally forgot about that. Um, maybe free up another player here. You stay put. Okay, cool. Support the screen, baby. Wait a minute, is this a two die? No, not yet. Gotta do. Ah, oh, that's a two day. So that supports the screen here. Um, let's not follow up. Just stay here. Not even a stun, sadly. Get in closer. Yeah, I need all my gals back there. Oh, he doesn't have block, that's cool. Oh, finally. So, we don't have block. Who do we want to attack? The Russell piece, I guess. Also marking this guy, if it works. So, wow, calm down, girl. <laughs> Um, yeah, let's stay here. Oh, maybe even go back a little. Second screen here. And we're good. We can still attack here, but I think he has to invest a few scale in order to do that. Please don't scatter like crap. I want to come from here. I feel better this way. Nice. Can go all the way up here. I think that should be safe. Okay, so much for that part. That went well. Three versus three rerolls. If I score now, I do get more players, but on the other hand, he still has nine players. Okay, he's attacking the armor value 8 piece, that's interesting. Hmm, yeah. Let's close this gap here. And he's going back. I like that. He's just a star player. He doesn't belong to my team. We can attack him. Okay, that's some odd screen. Way out in... No man's land. Those are four women, exactly enough for a cage. And maybe put up two in front of them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think I want to stay close to the sidelines, even if you can uh, put some pressure on me that way. But do I? The middle is just too open. He, he can mark all of them. At least here he can just mark the sides of the cage. And maybe I can, like, fend him off a bit there. Or maybe even go with the sideline cage again. I need all my, my men, my woman power, I guess. Okay. Catch her in front, so she can maybe get a hand off if need be. Where's the other catcher? Totally on the wrong side of everything. Let's see us here for that. We can gain some ground if we go in here. Two squares, he will push her to the side, I guess. So... That's actually 
split sim so we can be a little more comfortable. This is a dangerous piece, so it makes sense to mark him. But we need to move her first. Hmm. Support this even more now. If this goes wrong, that's not good. I think I want to support this cage structure here. Um, yeah, put you here. Also as a support for her. So it's not so easy to get some tackle zones in here. So the lower end of the cage is a bit weak at the moment here. Um, let's make this a two square screen. Okay, this guy can move in here now to mark him and then we'll hopefully push that game away. Yes, that is good enough. Stay. So we have some ground covered here. You can go around here but that's also a bit risky, right? This is like if he doesn't properly invest here, there's a threat of surfing. And I don't have to go this way, I can just go around if he opens, if he invests too much into this. So, 1-1. One, one. Normally I should run the clock down, I guess. Scaling us so fast, they might even go for a one turn touchdown. Hmm. He has enough players for this, I think. He has a movement 12 piece, so yeah, that's pretty easy for him to do. Uh, the blitz is out of the way and he's putting up a screen here, that's interesting. Not seeking direct contact. I can punch a hole in here maybe? Just move a bit back to the center. So I am threatening going to the left again. How many squares do we make this way? I'll just go in here because there is even more space here I think. So. Might be okay. She has to dodge out then. Let's see. Yeah, I think I'll go for this. Um, this is open at the moment. Yeah, let's use her. Though I don't really like it. She's already guarding this empty space here. A bit. Was that the right angle? Who knows? No, it's too late. <laughs> Stay here. Um, how far up do we want to go, actually? Maybe already move a little to the left here. You can invest like at the uh, front end of the cage, I guess. Caused me some trouble here. But I don't know if he has enough players to do this properly. Uh, let's make this a two square screen. Um, get you closer as well. Um, yeah, since the storm vermin is up there, I guess I'm going in here as well. Nah, it's giving up too much space. Let's go here, screen this off a bit. So it's not too easy to go around. He can blitz her and then he has, can like swarm the cage from all sides, but that's also a blitz gone, right? 
Where do I want to go with her, though? Speaking of swarming the lower part of the cage. Okay, just lay there then. Or not. Go out. So we're one girl down now. That's quite some pressure on us to score. Look at this shit. Four, seven, seven out. That's almost a whole team. Holy fuck balls. Maybe I should score. If I can. Are you in scoring range? Probably not. No, two squares missing. Interesting choice. Not connecting here. Just marking her, I guess. What is this? This is a lineman, not a gutter runner. Well, I only need to make two squares, but time is also running away here. I'm not sure that is what I want to do. Can I push her a bit? No, I don't think I can. Maybe I want to place a scoring threat here. Oh, he's opening up a bit. That's good. I like that. If he moves away from here. Things are not that tight anymore. Just a two-row screen here. So, where do we want to gain some ground? Hmm. Yes, attack him and mark him then. Mark maybe both pieces here. But I don't have enough players, look at this. I only have two guys that are free here. That cage is not really moving. What if I get in here? Uh, I cannot really push you to the side, sadly. I can only push you here. That would bring some pressure, though. Yeah, maybe I'll do this somehow. This feels like a good idea. Maybe open the lower part of the cage for this? No, that won't work. If this fails, and that's only a one die, hmm. I could go up one square, and it, and it would be a two die. Yeah, that's it. Ah, boy, oh boy. We could also make this a sideline cage then. But we will have to go like here, way back here. That's not good. So I think I'd rather we'll do it this way first. I don't think I can follow up here. That's too much pressure. So now I can build a sideline cage here. So she has some room if she, if she gets support. Um, or I could stay like it is and hope for the best that they don't get in possibility to break in here, but I think that's not a good idea. Let's make this a sideline cage. Get the catcher here, so we can do a handoff maybe. Probably not. So, he will. I'm pretty sure he'll invest some players in here, swarming the interesting part of the cage. But that also gives us more, gives me more room to breathe up here. Clock is ticking down. I could go for a draw as well. That wouldn't be 
Like, super embarrassing. It's just a one there. And that's a big fail. That's my chance to do something here now. Let's see. Let's see, where do we start? Um, if I come in here, I can push him there. If I blitz from here, I will, can push him out, but that, I cannot reach this place. Um, if I blitz here, he'll end up there. It doesn't really help us. So, if I push him up here, Hmm, no. Not sure. Let's start here. That's a good start. I like this. Nice. Getting a bit more even here. So I might stall all the way now, looking at how things are. Let's see, how many players do we have? Three, six, eight, and he has four. Seven, eight. So we're even at the moment. If I could get in here, but now I cannot as well. Mm, yeah, I cannot really get behind them here. What if I push you now? So I guess we'll have to do start here. At least it puts some pressure on them. We want to follow. Yeah, we need to box him in. And you are a block girl. A blotch girl. Yeah, sadly you will just push him here, but he'll, well, he will invest a lot here. And things won't look that fine anymore. Maybe I'll get served if things go bad. Look at this crap. Well, at least we have some scoring threats now. He's, like, in trouble. Um, maybe we can screen them off a bit. But this is also a problem. We can move the cage up. Um, I think I want to start by marking him. Those two players I don't I really don't like. And then maybe give you some room to breathe here. Some sort of screen here. Wait a minute, if I place you here, this still screen is still going. So either I support against them by giving them contact. Or, yeah, I think I need to go here. This puts more pressure on him. This weakens the lower side of the cage, sadly, but you can't have everything at once. Also gets us closer to the end zone. One square! Yay! We have three rerolls here, does have two. At least we, if we kill, if we hurt, we really kill, like, or at least injure. We really do some damage. Yeah, he can free himself out, but those are like three pressure points here. Is this, I'm sure that he doesn't like this marking as well, because the gutter runner is not strong enough for this. Storm vermin is used up in this, that's exactly what I wanted. So let's close this hole here. Maybe someone decides to go through there, not anymore. So they can they have to go come from up here, I guess. And not too many people left and for the blitz, and one of them is a gutter runner, and one is somewhat far away. And those are gutter runners as well. They're not that strong. This could be a good opportunity. There's nothing worse than a early turnover. That really fucks up things badly. Yeah, so he frees up one guy and the other guy has to dodge, I think, and to attack on them. Ok, 
Okay. Interesting. If we do this right, this can still be a serve, but she needs a lot of support here now. Oh, he's stunned. That's sad. They're just lying there. How do we do this? She's the only one who can get here. She push him. Hmm. You can push him one square and then I go in. No. He needs to go first. I don't have any contact to him. So that's a bit shit. I think all I can do is like... Um... Use the opportunity to build up a cage here, I guess. And also get our piece in scoring range. If we are here with the ball carrier, then it's like here. One, two, three, six, eight. Yeah, she's already in scoring range then. And those are still a little bit under pressure. So let's move her out first. Um, no. Move you first. Then blitz you away. This will unmark this guy, free up that guy. Sadly. Um, that's not what I wanted. It's just a one die. Hmm. Do I want them to swarm this half screen? I'm not sure I like this. Ah, uh, man, this is really uh, tricky now. No. I gotta move a bit though. This is a problem. They will stand up soon. Hmm. I think I'll st stay put here then. And he can swarm and tag and mark me at some places here. He can blitz out. But I do get some more pressure in here and I'll have more pieces. Um, as a scoring threat as well. Um, just push you away, I guess. Man, those are bad roads. Hmm. Well, that has... that's gotta do. Hmm. Can he surf something? Not that easily, I think. He can come in here and then push, but his his guys are in the way. I anticipate that he will swarm the cage with three guys, and blitz one of those ants, or four guys if you count this guy. In. But he's also in uh, under pressure here then as a surfing threat. As a well, he can't be surfed, is what I mean. <laughs> If he just gets up to support the splits here. Um, this will be very curious. Very interesting to see where the blitz goes, you know. Mm -hmm. Surfing threat here. This is a screen still. Two turns for me. Hmm. That's good. I prefer that he tries to support this structure here. I can surf for now. Oh no, actually not. Ah, uh, yes, he can. Yeah. Were those two chaos? Holy crap. Hmm. 
That is a scarring threat, isn't it? Okay, we gotta regroup here now. He also only has one reroll. And I need... Uh, basically need scoring threats now hmm this is like very closed and boxed in he has two turns so that's a lot hmm Let's see. Yeah, I guess we'll get you up. He's out of blitz, so mark him. Hmm. Maybe we wanna like, go for it this way. Not sure. Wonder, wonder. This is all very risky now. Let's try doing it this way. No, I want to come from down here. Not especially lucky. Okay, so... What else do we have? Uh, this is taking opportunities away now. That's not what I want. Um, I think I just want to get them cl up closer here. Three, six, eight. Nah, that's not good enough. Hmm. We really want to go all in now. Let me see. Three, six, eight. Yeah, those would all be scoring threats. I guess that's better than nothing. Um, how far can you go? Only down here. Hmm. Yeah, this is not an easy decision here. Oof. Boy, oh boy. Get you up closer. One die, one die. Hmm. Nah, just stay here and put some more pressure on here and it's us again, sadly. I don't trust him, he can score too easily. I'd rather have a draw, to be honest. It's just a bit unlucky here with those four sweaters, sweltering heat, victims. That kind of uh, hindered my capabilities a bit too much. We still have a chance depending on how the roads go here now. I don't want any of those to go away here. That's more important. Sure, so they can get rid of those two guys. Maybe you can... Well, let's see what happens. Sidestep. He's already out of the game now. That's interesting. 
So he can blitz one of those two. Oh, he's going backwards. Hmm, that's still a scoring threat. I won't tolerate that at all. I will at least mark him if I can. Hmm, you can get through here. But it's not going to be easy. Let's see. Yeah, she can barely mark him. What else do we have? She could reach in theory. Can we like push them a bit better? If we come from here, push in here. Close this gap maybe. Push you here. Then I can push you in here. Uh, but that is still a bad move. Hmm. What if I... <coughs> hmm, I think I'll just have to dodge to at least one tackle zone here. Hmm, and that is also a tackle guy. Hmm, let's get you up. I don't have all day here. Get you up. Yeah, I'm investing in this. I don't care. Oh boy. Oh boy. Well, he has a chance at uh, scoring now. That's exactly what I don't want it. He has also a reroll. Well, well. Good game. A bit disappointing in the end. So let's see, he can uh, like push her out. Actually no, because he's moved. That's a dodge. That's a tackle though, okay. Interesting, I would have expected that he wanted that space to get in there. I guess he wants to attack here, but he has sidestep. Okay, he can, I see. He can push her out now, or not. Man, oh man. What a bench. I see. Sure. Without a reroll, though. Hmm. Not happy about this. Let's see where the bolts get us. Uh, yeah, he can reach. That's pretty shit. Okay, nothing happens. Wouldn't be deserved, if you ask me. That I lose, I mean. If the draw is deserved, mm, I don't know. Yeah, a one. Whatever, I don't really need the money, to be honest. Um, 
Yeah, statistics, statistics, who wants statistics? Same block sustained, 11 KOs, 4 casualties, so 11 versus 6. That's a bit much, don't you think? Um, oh, we get some SPP again. Injury failure, 37. No failure at all. That's pretty good, huh? Let me see. Those dice. Well, evenly spread, I guess. That is a bit unlucky here. Anyway, let's see what a team got. Twenty K. Well, we're rich, everybody. We're freaking rich. Another blood girl. Okay, no. That is interesting. Um. Well. 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 Well, there you go. Um, yeah, you're even a bit more expensive than the Blotch Girl. Great. So, that was a boring draw. <laughs> Thanks for watching, anyways. See you next time. Bye bye.